just wanted to do kind of a collective Joanne's Michael's haul. Um, this is across a period of time and just some some things that I found that I wanted to share. Um, first of all, I know you guys have all seen this. I'm just super excited because I actually found, I did not buy this before Halloween and when Halloween clearance went on, I couldn't find this. Um, it was 40% off, but it wasn't on clearance, which I think at this point Halloween's over, guys, but they must have realized this was a pretty popular set, so they have it out with their regular collection, but I just adore that little pumpkin girl, and the witch is cute, and um, so I'm excited about that, but anyway, so if you guys, if any of you wanted it and didn't, didn't necessarily, um, you know, want to pay full price for it. They're on sale right now for 40% off. So, um, and then I, I'm sure everybody is showing the Christmas, the Recollections Christmas stacks. Um, and this weekend, in case you didn't know, um, well, today is November 11th, so Veterans Day. Um, thank you to all you vets out there. Um, and I just, they're having a sale at Michael's. Um, where they're, they have a lot of their stuff 40% off and then an additional 25% off, even on sale items, um, which they don't normally do. And of course they pick and choose. It's mostly just their recollections collections. But anyway, so um, I ended up picking up a few paper pads that I probably wouldn't normally have picked up without that extra 25% off. Um, and so I thought I'd share those with you. Um, because they're really, really pretty, and I've eyed them a few times and passed them up because I have way too much paper, but um, that doesn't stop me. <laughs> I love it so much. Um, so this is the Charming Collection from Recollections, and I thought I'd just go through it for those of you who maybe haven't seen it. I love this. My camera isn't really doing it. I don't know if the colors are off, maybe just a little bit, but... Um, just really fun, distressed. It's all one-sided. It's a pretty, you know, it's a decent paperweight. Love that numbered one. So, I like the colors in this. Um, this isn't something that I, you know, I'll use it for a lot of different things, I think. So, um, but yeah, I love that ledger paper. You guys I've seen this as a pattern for me. <laughs> um, but just a, just really pretty. And I know some of the other collections have been, for example, the Portobello Road was actually in my mind's eye one. If anybody knows if this is like a other paper, um, like another company's brand that they're like redoing, I'd be curious to know. I didn't recognize it, but that doesn't mean I... I would know for sure. And then um, the next one that I got is Graceful. I thought that was really pretty too. There was one other one that's kind of a fall stack, but I just I held myself back. So again, I really like the colors in this one. Just really rich, rich colors. And, and lots of glitter too here and there um, on the stack. So. Um, just some fun patterns. More ledgers. And this is a, a little glittery, subdued glitter. It's not like super sparkly, but it's still on there. Um, it's almost like a frost of some kind. I don't know how to describe it. It's not like a little glittery, but I like that. Um, like almost every page has it on, on there. So that one doesn't, but, um, oops. Really pretty. Okay, so those were two that I wanted to share, and then again, the others that I had were some of the Christmas stacks that I'm sure you guys have all seen and other people are showing. Um, if you want me to go through it, I have one that's Oh Christmas Tree, and then another that's the ballet. Um, I know a number of people have showed this gorgeous colors. Um, so, and then. <laughs> Oh, another one. Um, the Naughty or Nice, which I really, really love because, I mean, I, I really do think that there's, you know, papers in here you don't have to use for the holidays, but... Oh, that green. Okay, I'm not going to 
go over that. So then um, tonight I went to Joanne's too because I thought that you could use your, I thought they honored um, Michael's coupons, but I feel like I've been here in the past where they say, no, we don't honor the 25% off on everything. So even though they just did it themselves last weekend, so they won't honor it, fine, I understand. Um, I would have picked up a few more things. Um, one thing that I did pick up, though, is this Colorbox Flea Market paper. And I know Bona just showed this, and I've eyed it up so many times. I finally just went for it. So, so pretty. Okay. Um, then the other thing I just wanted to mention um, was that, and now I've covered up with all my heavy paper pack. So, for magazines, I rarely look at them. You don't get discounts on them. Um, I subscribe myself to, at home, Cards Magazine which is a bit of a splurge, but I absolutely love this magazine. It's my little happy place some evenings before I go to bed. So um, I'm sure my husband wouldn't appreciate me saying that because I'm like, he'd rather I talk to him than sit and look at my cards magazine. But anyway, um, <laughs> I, so I had watched um, Rashida's, oh my gosh, I can't, MMDO. I will put it down in the link below because she totally recommended um, these magazines and she actually got them from Bridget, Shoe Princess One, um, in terms of the recommendation. So I'll just start. But um, this Holiday Cards uh, magazine, at, she got it at Michael's. Well, I saw it at Joanne's and she raved about this uh, magazine and I have to say it does have a lot of really neat projects and card ideas in it. Um, and yeah, I think Bridget made this card or one similar, so go check out her video too. But um, so this holiday cards is $14.95. I just won't pay that for a magazine. So they had them 10% off. And then you could use a 25% off coupon. So Joann's will honor percentages off on their uh, magazines and that's what I just wanted to share because I thought now is the time for me to pick up some magazines I wouldn't normally so here's paper crafts there's some cute stuff in there and then <laughs> I just pretty much followed her recommendations creating keepsakes and scrapbooks etc so as you guys know I always do cards so I like to try to do some layouts here um, and maybe some more mini books because I haven't done that in a long time. So um, I just wanted to share that. Is there anything else? Um, if one other thing, I don't know. These were really hidden at my Michaels, but um, these Seven Gypsies um, pay, um, photo trays. They're like the printer's photo trays. They have the little things at the top and then they fit four by six and they have some for ATC size. They were like hidden in the strangest spot in my Michaels. It's like they didn't want to sell them or something. I have no idea. There weren't that many. Um, I picked up a couple of them. They were on clearance for $11.99. I don't know if that's a good price or not. That's what ours were. Um, you can decide for yourself. I thought that was... A decent price for um, something that I'm going to be making some Christmas gifts with. So, and as usual, I'm running out of time, so I'm going to end now. But just a reminder, guys, I'm having a giveaway of a MFP sentiment stamp set um, on my video. Um, it, it does have giveaway in the title, so please go and leave a comment, watch the video, and um, thanks for watching. Bye.